My name is Isabel Guerrero, and I am a Chief Petty Officer in the United States Navy. My relationship with my mom is, we're very close. We're very alike. It's almost scary. Yeah. <laughs> Nos gusta hacer las mismas cosas, trabajar en los mismos proyectos. Cualquier cosita que nos ponemos a hacer, tomar café. <laughs> it's embarrassing me now. <laughs> What made me interested in the military really was gaining some independence. I wanted to make my parents proud and I was ready for some adventure and I wanted to see the world. I wanted to see more than just San Antonio. I had never even been on an airplane before. Yo me siento muy orgullosa que mi hija y mi otra hija, mi hijo también están en el military. Esta decisión que tomó ella para mí era la mejor decisión que ella podía haber hecho. I originally started off as an STG2, which is a sonar technician second class, and I was lucky to be able to come back home to my hometown here in San Antonio now as a division leading chief petty officer of Division 6. Future Sailor Chief request permission to come aboard? Come aboard. As a Navy career counselor, what I do on a daily basis is I train, mentor, and reward sailors. I'm able to be here in my hometown and reach out to Latinos here and let them know that you can do something. You don't have to stay here. There is so much more out there in this world. My most exciting adventure in the Navy would be probably meeting my husband. So most adventurous and most memorable. <laughs> Maduro muy pronto, porque en, en los lugares que ha ido ella, uh, ha tenido casa, dinero, carro. Ella me ha ayudado mucho. As long as you're moving forward, you're going somewhere. I have a lot of specific things that I talk to with my female future sailors. One of the biggest things is don't be afraid to step out of your comfort zone. There are a lot of jobs that are non-traditional. And now every single job that we have in the Navy is open to women, including Navy SEALs. So there is nothing that you can't do. Me gustaría decirle a los padres y madres que Escuchen a sus hijos o hijas que si tienen esa idea y quieren agarrar esa oportunidad de meterse en el military, que los dejen. Van a ser bien.